Assalamu alaikum. My name is Arif Mansouri and I'm the host of the Mansouri Show. The show that is best described as Milaunga, Bataunga, Dikhaunga. Your link to everything Pakistani straight from California, the Mansouri Show. Nazreen, today we are in the University of Southern California, where the Pakistan Student Association of USC and the Pakistan Student Association of UCLA has a great deal. This is a great deal. हमारे नए सफीर पाकिस्तान एम्बेसडर टू यूएस जनाब एजाज अहमद चौधरी के लिए उन्होंने मुनक्कद की और इसमें हम आपको इस रिपोर्ट की झलकें दिखाएंगे आज हम इसमें आपको हिज एक्सेलेंसी एजाज अहमद चौधरी की स्पीच और उनका स्टूडेंट के साथ इंटरेक्शन और पाकिस्तानी अमेरिकन डिसेंट यूथ है उसके जो कमेंट्स हैं वो हम आपको सुनाएंगे तो आइए इस तकरीब के हवाले से हमारी रिपोर्ट मुलाजह फरमाइए हमारी बहुत खुशनसीबी है कि इस वक्त हमारे साथ एम्बेसडर ऑफ पाकिस्तान टू द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स हिज एक्सेलेंसी जनाब एजाज अहमद चौधरी साहब मौजूद हैं सबसे पहले तो मैं आपको प्रोग्राम का खुशाम कर कम करते हैं सो मच फॉर ट्राइंग दस शुक्रिया जी बहुत मेहरबानी बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया पाकिस्तान आप यहाँ पर वेस्ट कोस्ट पे इस वक्त मौजूद हैं आपने हाल ही में पाकिस्तान के एम्बेसडर टू यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स का उदय का शार्ट किया और ये आपका सफीर है पाकिस्तान पहला दौरा है मैं चाहूँगा कि आप हमारे नाजरीन को इस دورے کی نویت اور اس کے اعتراض محفاظت سے آگا کرتا ہے جی ضرور بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم میں اس وقت کیلیفورنیا میں ہوں بلکہ اس وقت یونیورسٹری آف سدن کیلیفورنیا میں بیٹھے ہیں اور ابھی ہم نے پاکستانی نجات جتنے یہاں پہ ابھی کی طالب علم ہیں ان کے ساتھ بات چیت کی ایک بہت بڑا گروپ تھا اس سے بار کی صبح یہ اٹھ کر آئے بڑا اچھا لگا اس سے لگتا ہے کہ ان کے ساتھ جو ان کے دلوں میں ایک پاکستان سے محبت کا ایک جذبہ ہے وہ کام اور اس کو ساتھ جو ہے وہ ہمارا ایک بہت قیمتی احساسہ ہے تو پرسو میں باسٹن میں تھا وہاں پہ میں جو ہاورڈ میں پاکستانی سٹوڈنٹ تھے ان سے ملا فلیشر میں جو پاکستانی سٹوڈنٹ تھے ان سے ملا ٹرپس میں تو مجھے ایسا یعنی یہ محسوس ہو رہا ہے کہ جو پاکستان کا جو پیغام ہے آج کے پاکستان کا پیغام ہے جو محبت اور سلامتی کا پیغام ہے جو ہم اور آشتی کا پیغام ہے جو ترقی اور خوشحالی کا پیغام ہے جو دہشتگردی کے خلاف ہماری کامیابیوں کے بڑھتے ہوئے سلسلے کا نام ہے جو اقتصادی میدان میں پاکستان کے آگے بڑھتے ہوئے جو سلسلے اس کا نام ہے اس کو دیاں پر بتانا ہے اور میں کوشش کر رہا ہوں کہ پاکستانی جو کمیٹی ہے تقریباً دس لاکھ سوٹ پر پاکستانی بارکی کی کمیٹی ہے وہ اور ہم ایک آپس میں شراکت آئے ہیں اور ہم یہاں کے لوگوں کو بتائیں کہ پاکستان تو محبت اور سلامتی کا ہوتا ہے اور ہم چاہتے ہیں کہ پاکستان اور امریکہ کے درمیان جو تعلقات ہیں وہ توانہ ہو کبھی ہو مضبوط ہو اور اس کے لیے سب سے اچھا کام تو یہ ہے کہ اگر پاکستان کی جو اگلی نسل پاکستانی وائٹ کی سیکنڈ جنریشن کو ہے وہ بیٹر نہ پکڑے اور پاکستان کی امریکہ کی جو پہلی نسل کی نسل تھی ان سے وہ بیٹر لے کر وہ بھی آگے اس کو پوچھے جاتے ہیں جو پہلی نسل ہے ان کا بھی اپنا ایک مقام ہے انہوں نے بہت کردار ادا کیا ہے جس طرح آپ بھی آئیں تیس سال پہلے اور آپ آپ کے بچوں کا دور دے گا جو وہ جانے دے کہ وہ سرزمین کو اور پاکستان کی سرزمین کو ایک دوسرے کے قریب لائے تو ایک تو میرا بہت بڑا مقصد یہ ہے اس طرح ہم بھی آنے کا اور باقی ریاستوں میں بھی جاؤں گا تاکہ جتنے پاکستانی کمیلٹی ہیں سپیشلی جو پاکستانی سٹوڈنٹس ہیں یوز کیوں ہماری ہے وہ اس معاملے کو اس سلسلے کو ہمارے ساتھ بل کر آگے پلانز ہماری یہ ہے کہ دیکھیں یہ سال ہے جب امریکہ اور پاکستان کے صفاقی تعلقات کو قائم ہوئے ستر سال ہوئے اور یہ ہماری ستر سال کی آزادی کی داستان بھی ہے تو ہم یہ چاہتے ہیں کہ اس سال جو ہے پاکستانی سفارتانہ پاکستانی کانسلمانے اور تمام پاکستانی آرکنزیشنز جو ہیں اور پاکستانی سپیشلی سٹوڈنٹس ہو یہ سارے مل کر ہم اس کا جشن مانے اور ہم یہ چاہتے ہیں کہ پورے طول و عرض میں یہ پیغام پھیلائیں کہ پاکستان اور امریکہ کی دوستی کے جو ستر سال ہونے کو آئے ان کا آتا کریں اور اس کو آگے لکھا چلیں ہم بہت سارے بیلنس بنوا رہے ہیں سٹیڈیز بنوا رہے ہیں میں نے لوگوں بنوایا ہے اور ان کو انشاءاللہ ہم دیکھیں گے کہ ہم پھیلائیں گے چاہوں طرف کیونکہ ہمیں یہ پیغام کو جانا ہے کہ پاکستان اور امریکہ کے تعلقات جو ہیں ان کو حکم کے پاکستان پاکستان کے عوام بہت اہمیت دیتے ہیں اور ہم یہ چاہتے ہیں کہ یہ تعلقات جو ہیں مسیح کو سکتے ہیں
हमने पाकिस्तानी कम्युनिटी वहाँ पे भी इसी तरह बड़ी मोहिम बेवतन कम्युनिटी थी उनके साथ मिलकर एक पब्लिक डिप्लोमेसी ये उस समय में नया नाम ईजाद हो रहा था पब्लिक डिप्लोमेसी हमने कहा कि चलिए उसका एक्सपेरिमेंट करते हैं कि किस तरीके से पाकिस्तान का असल और खूबसूरत चेहरा नेदरलैंड की आवाम को दिखाया जाए और हमने बहुत सारे सिलसिले शुरू किया आपने सही कहा स्पोर्ट्स के अंदर भी हॉकी टूर्नामेंट क्रिकेट टूर्नामेंट गोल्फ टूर्नामेंट इसी तरह कल्चर वाली साइड के ऊपर म्यूजिक के हवाले से उसने तो वो एक रिकॉर्ड हमने बनाया और एक कहानी से लिखी गई किस तरीके से पाकिस्तानी सफारत खान था जो है और पाकिस्तानी कम्युनिटी जब मिलकर काम करते हैं तो कैसी कामयाबी अल्लाह ताला करता है ये उसकी दास्तान है आप सभी पाकिस्तान को अभी अपने चार्ज लिया है लेकिन आप अभी तो पाकिस्तान के जो हमारे तल्लुक है उस पर आप माहिर बताने जाते हैं और आपने उसी में काफी बहुत अपना आपकी तारीफ की आपने टफ यूनिवर्सिटी में मैसेजुसेट में आपने मास्टर्स किया इंटरनेशनल रिलेशन में उसके बाद उसके हवाले से भी आपका बहुत पिता के साथ बहुत मदद देगी जी इसकी वजह यह है कि मैं ये समझता हूँ कि पाकिस्तान और अमरीका के तालुक में जाती तौर पर अपने तजर्बे से भी समझता हूँ कि पाकिस्तान और अमरीका के तालुक बहुत कलीदी अहमियत के हमारे और पाकिस्तान और अमरीका के तालुक जो है वो आज से नहीं है सत्तर साल से जुड़े मुल्कों ने बेशुमार मैदानों में काम किया है तो इस वक्त भी मैं बहुत सारे ऐसे शोबे हैं जिनका शायद लोगों को ज्यादा अंदाजा भी नहीं आज भी कितने पाकिस्तानी तालब अमरीका की यूनिवर्सिटियों में पढ़ने आते हैं आज भी पाकिस्तान अमरीका में पाकिस्तान से आए हुए डॉक्टरों की तादाद कुछ हम कहते हैं पचास हजार से ज्यादा अपना भी खुद अपने रजिस्टर्ड तादाद अठारह हजार इसके अलावा सेहत के शोबे के अलावा आई टी का जो शोबा है जरात के शोबे में यहाँ से अगर आपको याद होगा तो कैलिफोर्निया और फैसलाबाद एग्रीकल्चर यूनिवर्सिटी ने एक इंटाफ जरात का लिया तो आज भी उस पर एग्रीकल्चर के हवाले से बात हो रही है काम हो रहा है तो इतने शोबे हैं तो मैं बहुत उम्मीद हूँ मुसूरी साहब कि ये इन सिलसिला जो है ये बड़े काम है और अगर हमारे जज्बे ठीक हो और अगर हम सही जगहों पर जाके तारे मिलाएं और सही बातें करें लोगों के साथ और यहाँ पे भी मुझे नजर आया है कि लोगों में ये दिल है उनका उनकी ख्वाहिश है कि हम पाकिस्तान के साथ ताल्लुक को मजीद मजबूत करें इन तमाम शोबों में और वही होता है आपने अपनी तकलीफ में कह दी कहा और आज भी ये कहा कि तमाम देशों और कंट्रीज जो है उसने ना तो कोई कौन से आ होता है ना मतलब शायद होता है शेड और ग्रे तो पाकिस्तान में मशरक खान जैसे भी वाक होते हैं लेकिन फिर पाकिस्तान में जो कि लिटरेसी का रेट है उसकी ग्रोथ भी ट्रेंडस है हमारे आपने इकोनॉमिक तरक्की की बात करी हमारा डेफिसिट आठ परसेंट से जीरो फाइव परसेंट आ गया हमारा जो इंटरनेशनल रिजर्व है वो अठारह बजे से ऊपर चले गए आपने मैंशन किया कि हमारी ग्रोथ ग्रोथ रेट जो है फोर पॉइंट सेवन का तो इतनी सारी जो है इसमें पॉजिटिविटी भी है आप पाकिस्तान का फ्यूचर क्या बनते हैं मैं यही देखता हूँ कि जी पाकिस्तान का फ्यूचर मुस्तफे तो माशा जी का और ये सिर्फ पाइप प्राइस वाटर हाउस ऊपर को नजर नहीं आ रहा कि बीस तीस में क्या होगा या गोल्डमैन सैक्स को सिर्फ नजर आ रहे हो या फोर्स को या ब्लूमबर्ग को या किसी और को मैं आपको बताऊं कि जो भी चश्मे बिना है जो देख सकती है नजर 
तो देख देख ये बोल किधर जा पर इंशाल्लाह ये आगे बहुत जाएगा बोल अपना इत्तेमाद रखिए इसके अंदर बोल के अंदर ईमान रखिए अगर कमिटमेंट हो तो खुदा ताला बदत करता है वो फदारी बशत्ते उस तबारी असली ईमान the crane of of uh, of faith is commit and i think that is what we have that's what we need pegam mera jo aap puchna cha rahe the community ke liye kya hai pegam yahi hai ki apne mulk mein apne logon mein imaan rakhe ye mohabbat karne wale log ye am ke dai aur inke sath aur pakistan aur yahan ke jo log hain inke darmiyan wo pul bane rahiye jo aap hai और दोनों मुल्कों के दरमियान तालु किसी भी एक शोबे को उठा ले और उनको उसको मजीद मजबूत करेंगे आप इस मुल्क की भी खिदमत करेंगे और उस मुल्क की भी जहाँ से आप और आप जो जो है बड़े बहुत शुक्रिया बहुत शुक्रिया नाजीन आप देख रहे हैं हमारी रिपोर्ट यू एस सी में होने वाली पाकिस्तान स्टूडेंट एसोसिएशन की तकरीब जो कि पाकिस्तान के नए सफ़ी द एम्बेसडर ऑफ पाकिस्तान टू द यूनाइट स्टेट्स हिज एक्सलेंसी एजाज़ अहमद चौधरी के लिए उन्होंने मुनद की हमारे प्रोग्राम में वक्त हुआ एक छोटे से वक्फे का देखते रहिए वी विल बी राइट बैक नाजिन आप मुलाजा फरमा रहे हैं हमारी रिपोर्ट यू एस सी में मनद होने वाली एक तकरीब जो कि पाकिस्तान स्टूडेंट एसोसिएशन ऑफ़ यू एस सी और पाकिस्तान स्टूडेंट एसोसिएशन ऑफ यू सी एल ए ने मनद की और ये तकरीब पाकिस्तान के नए सफ़ी पाकिस्तान एम्बेसडर टू द यूनाइट स्टेट्स हिज एक्सलेंसी एजाज़ अहमद चौधरी के लिए मनद की गई थी आइए इस रिपोर्ट का बकिया हिस्सा मुलाजा फरमाइए which dealt with partition and genocide and hopefully this year in a few weeks we're going to have an event that concerns with terrorism and the untold stories of it um again uh thank you again for joining us today and i hope we have a great event a little bit about today's event it's very unique it's very special um today we are pleased to be joined by Mr. Azaz Ahmed Choudhury who has recently been appointed as a new ambassador to Pakistan to the United States For the first time in USC PSA's history, we have had an ambassador who was able to join Pakistani students here to engage in thought-provoking and engaging discussion. It is to no surprise that Ambassador Choudhury is an exceptional Pakistani diplomat who is incredible in all of his endeavors, dedicating over 34 years of service. And previously, he has served as a Foreign Secretary of Pakistan, as Pakistan's ambassador to the Netherlands, the spokesperson of the Foreign Ministry, as well as hand handling numerous affairs with the United Nations. We thank you Ambassador Choudhury for allowing us this opportunity. I would now like to call upon the ambassador to speak which will be followed by a Q&A session. Thank you so much uh, first and foremost uh, for uh, getting up that early in the morning on Sunday uh, and coming over and it's a pretty organized event I must say that I am impressed already with the Pakistan Students Association. Thank you Manur, thank you Nader. uh for putting it all together uh i i want to tell you that i'm really happy to be here amongst, amongst you um when i came here it was about a month and a half ago uh, and i noticed that uh, uh there were certain perceptions about pakistan that were prevailing which were certainly in my view lagging behind today's pakistan so i got on to meeting people <coughs> talking to different think tanks telling them what has happened in Pakistan and how we have been able to defeat the forces of terrorism we still are busy doing that but we have made considerable gains and how our economy is resurging and picking up and how many us companies are now actively participating in the pakistani economic life so i while i was doing that i it it so i was struck by a fact that the first generation pakistani americans who came somewhere in 60s and 70s uh, are bound by that uh, you know nostalgia to the country that they had left behind but the torch and the baton is not to be carried by them it is to be carried by the second generation and the third generation pakistani americans who are americans 
but as manur has rightly used the word uh, of pakistani heritage now each one of us has many identities you know you have these circles of identities which define you uh, and therefore one of the primary identity that you have is that of your heritage and united states is a remarkable country because it a uh, it assimilates and accommodates so many cultures at the same time and yet leave room for more uh, i like this country uh, i have been in this country for a for more than once i did my masters from tufts university in massachusetts and then i came back here in 1999 to serve in this embassy and then later in our uh, mission to the united nations in new york where i stayed 6 years plus so in that sense it is my fourth stint here my children grew up here my family loved this place uh, and i believe this is a remarkable country it's a country uh, which uh, is comprising of resilient people come country which has uh, Uh, fascinating values, which has kept the country together and also given it the strength that it needed to assume the leadership role that it has played. So all this endears us, me and my family, to to this country. So I was very happy when I was chosen to come here to represent a country uh, with which I believe this country has a very close bond. Uh, so when. when i came here and i felt that uh, somehow the image of pakistan had uh, suffered a blow um, in the past especially two decades since 9/11 the earlier generation your fathers your uncles uh, they did a wonderful job your mothers your your aunts and they i think uh, contributed to the development of this country and i think uh, uh, they still are doing in many ways but my desire and, and and would be to engage more and more with the pakistani american second generation and third generation and to see how they like their fathers and mothers could continue to serve as a bridge between this society and that society and we believe that pakistan united states relations must be strengthened must become stronger and that's what that's the mandate that has been given to me and to our consul general uh, mr mehman so that that's the that's that's the agenda we want to but we want to do it with you together with the pakistani american community we have a million plus pakistani american community who are a solid bridge a real bridge between that country and this country and since you are now about to take that bet on in your own hands very soon you will be in in the practical life i thought that it would be my duty to reach out to you i am meeting i met the psa in harvard i met the psa in tufts i am uh, i plan to meet meet the psa in columbia i'm glad that mr mehman and and his colleagues and nader and manur have put together this and thank you so much for sparing your sunday morning uh but we need partnership and i'm i was so glad to hear that you already organized a number of events i think that is what is needed events which project the soft and the real image of pakistan so khatam usc mein maujood hai jahan par ke abhi abhi ambassador of pakistan his excellency aziz ahmed choudhury ne ek brilliant speech di let's ask the the youth what they think of this speech so right now over here i have the usc uh, psa board and so i'll begin with you mahnoor uh, umair Uh, so, what is your opinion of Ambassador's speech today? I thought it was really inspiring. I thought it was great that he could take the time out of his busy schedule to come and speak to um, Pakistani college students and young professionals in the Los Angeles area that haven't been able to hear someone of that stature, of that um, 
person who can fill a diplomatic seat for us um, and have our voices heard and we can ask questions and engage in a thought-provoking discussion and I think that it's steps like that that will move our country forward and build a bridge between the United States and Pakistan so I thought it was really great. My name is Kieran Chagan and my major is International Relations Global Business. I'm a senior at USC so I it was an honor to have the Ambassador of the Excellence at USC speaking to all the students and young professionals and it was really good to see on how he wants us to work and continue the continue making the bridge between the US and Pakistan and where we come from and continue to be proud of our heritage so that just really built us uh, a lot of strength within us to continue and um, just be very proud of our nation and where we come from my name is Abbas Husseini I am a, uh, doing my masters in electrical engineering and I really enjoyed the event today helping put it on was you know, one of the highlights of our semester, and he, uh, the ambassador, shared some like really inspiring and promising words. And I'm excited to see what comes from Pakistan in the in the coming years, and to keep up and, and read more about it as the months progress. Hi, um, I'm Elisa. I'm a business major. Um, yeah, same. I thought it was a great event. It's I've heard about a lot of issues I hear my parents talk about, so it was great to get that connection back to Pakistan on, in such a hands-on way. Um, and I also look forward to hearing what happens in the future. Hi, my name is Aruba. Um, I'm a film major and um, likewise I think it was amazing uh, having the ambassador come out here and you know share his thoughts. Um, I believe that we all share the same sentiments and um, yeah it was, a real, it was a privilege to hear him talk about how Pakistani heritage matters so much in our community and it's important for all of us to be resilient and I just hope that we're able to do that more and more throughout um, this administration and how times are today. Hello, my name is Raza and I'm a computer science major. And having the ambassador, especially the new ambassador to the US here um, in one of his like first few months in office uh, was incredible because his message of like connecting Pakistan and the US through Pakistani Americans is something we especially need right now in these times and I feel like his message was overall like very uplifting and lifted the gloom out of the situation that many Pakistani Americans think that we're in. I am with you at UCLA and PSA Pakistan Student Association board module. You have listened to Ambassador Saab's speech and what is your opinion about this speech? My name is Fariha, I'm a psychobiology major and I thought it was a privilege to be able to listen to the Ambassador speak today. Um, I am a second generation born in America, my parents immigrated and I always feel very ignorant about what's occurring and what is happening in Pakistan so I feel like I'm, I'm very pleased that the ambassador came to the youth today particularly because he's giving us, like providing us an outlet to have a voice and I, I learned so much today, I learned about what's occurring and I, I'm very thankful. Assalamu alaikum. My, uh, my name is Aisha and I'm a political science major at UCLA. Um, I believe the connection is really necessary in, and having the ambassador speak today and, and being able to hear his views and like having him take questions, it was really important. And um, I think events like this just like bring the community together and I'm an international student from Pakistan and being in an environment where there's both international and American born Pakistanis, it was really like it was really engaging and I hope like this continues to happen. Assalamu alaikum. Uh, my name is Nader. I'm a fourth year developmental economics and political science major. Um, I think today's event was extremely necessary for the Los Angeles community because we've never had an event like this before. Uh, I would like to thank the ambassador for coming out to LA. Thank you so much. And uh, my name is Zulka the Rahman and I'm professionally an accountant uh, studying at UCLA. And I believe I talked to um, uh, the ambassador and uh, he's a man of uh, uh, you know high values and integrity and uh, really uh, you know uh, we own that he's here and uh, uh, we're looking forward at UCLA and uh, LA consulate and uh, you know Pakistani embassy uh, we keep on doing a lot and lot of events and uh, yeah uh, thank you uh, I'm Shagaf I'm a finance grad um, I like to say like this event was really well held it was nicely planned and we'd like to thank the ambassador for coming out. He has some good words to say. Uh, I would say though that the Q&A session, he could have held it a little bit better. Some of the questions I felt they were dodged and you know I would prefer if he answered it to the point in the future. I want to tell you that you have listened to the ambassador's speech and you have 
के बारे में मालूम हुआ आपको कि वो क्या करना चाहते हैं फ्यूचर में यूथ के साथ आप एम्बेसडर ऑफ पाकिस्तान जनाब एजाज अहमद चौधरी साहब को क्या मैसेज देना चाहेंगे वॉट शुड यू डू टू एंगेज द यूथ मोर एंड मेक अ वेरी इफेक्टिव रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन द कौंसलेट एम्बेसी एंड द यूथ ऑफ पाकिस्तानी अमेरिकन डिसेंट Assalamu alaikum my name is Hamza I'm an econ economics and psychology major at UCLA uh first of all I would like to thank the ambassador and USC PSA for having us over uh the ambassador's speech uh comprised of mainly engaging the youth especially Pakistani Americans in the greater Los Angeles area and to help them empower the overall reputation of all Pakistani Americans here and for me it is a very uh, important step that needs to be taken uh, one suggestion i would like to give the ambassador is as there are a large number of international students who are pakistani as well in in this area should be included as well in these plans and uh, the steps taken should not just be confined to pakistan second generation pakistani american students here assalamu alaikum my name is mahad i'm a second year economic student and um i would like to thank the ambassador and the consul general for coming out i think it was a great event i think that a lot of the rhetoric that he pushed i agree with personally um but i just want to see him get out actual programs which can implement what he's saying when it comes to bridging the gap between pakistani americans and pakistanis at home uh because right now i think we just rely a lot on family relationships there are no um organized or official ch uh, channels that he can uh that we can use. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Umar. I'm a third year economic major from Karachi. Um uh, I think everyone's pretty much covered uh positives of this event. I would just like to emphasize the fact that the ambassador um stressed how important students are uh in this entire uh, relationship with Pakistan and the United States. Uh and I think it's very important to educate second generation Pakistani Americans who are not aware of our history uh and current situation in Pakistan and how important it is that we out here are doing our best for our country. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. I'm Junaid. I'm a fourth year computer science major and the um, one suggestion I would have for the ambassador is that he should get the council to be more involved in like events with UCLA, USC and other universities because I think that is the best platform for engaging with students. Nazreen, aapne hamari ye report mulahaza farmayi jo ke USC mein munaqid hone wali ek taqreeb ke hawale se thi. Ye taqreeb hamare Pakistan ke naye safir एम्बेसडर ऑफ पाकिस्तान टू द यूनाइट स्टेट्स हिज एक्सलेंसी एजाज अहमद चौधरी के लिए पाकिस्तान स्टूडेंट एसोसिएशन ऑफ यू एस सी और यू एस सी एल ए ने मनद की थी उम्मीद है ये रिपोर्ट आपको पसंद आई होगी हमें अपनी आरा से आगे करते रहिए आपके स्क्रीन पर जो एड्रेस है उस पर हमें अपना फीडबैक अपने कामेंट भेजते रहिए और हमारे प्रोग्राम की पिछली एपिसोड्स को देखने के लिए प्लीज़ विजिट पाकिस्तान लिंक डॉट कॉम स्लैश ए आर वाई हमारे प्रोग्राम का वक्त अब ख़त्म हुआ अपना ख्याल रखिएगा खुदा हाफिज़